So we are going to do a couple multi-digit divided by multi-digit division problems. And unfortunately, there's no real easy way to do this. And it's going to be a little bit of trial and error. So it's the same process, the divide, multiple, subtract, or multiply, subtract, bring down. So 25. So we cannot go into 1 or 16. So I'm doing 25 divided by 163 would be my first. So I know 25 cents is a quarter. So four of them would equal $1, which would be only 100. And two more would be 50 cents. So that would be six. If I had seven of them, that would be 175 though. So I'm gonna try six. And so six times 25 is 150. So if I have six quarters, I have $1.50. Now we get to the subtract. Three, one, so 13. And I can't, I know I'm right because I can't do, make a group of 25 out of 13. So now I bring down my next number. So now I am figuring out 25 divided by 130. So I know four quarters would be a hundred dollars and 25 is left 30 so I'm going to try five. Now we multiply five times 25 is 125. Now we're on to subtract. Can't do that so I need to borrow five. Now, I can't make another group. I have no more numbers to bring down. So my answer is 65 remainder five. Let's try one more. And these are problems from your worksheet that I picked. 19 to five, or 152 divided by 19. And a helpful hint, would be to, this is where estimating comes into help. So 19 is close to 20. So when I'm looking at this and say, well, 20, I can't do it in one or 16. So I can look at the whole number of one, two, three, two. So, hmm. Let's skip count. So 20, 40, 50, 80. 100, 120, 140. Nope, I can't do 162. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I have to do the whole number. So I'm going to write like seven above the two. So, I'm going to multiply two times. So, seven times 20 is 140. So, and that's going to be less. Now, seven times nine is 63. And then seven times one is seven, but I have to add my six. So, 13. so seven times nine is 133. Now we subtract. Can't do that. So I need to borrow nine. See? And I know I'm not right because I can make another group. So I'm going to rewrite it. This is where this is where we check it and completely finish the problem so we know it's right. So I know it's going to be eight. 
and then 19 times 8 is 72. This is 8 plus 7 to be 15. So 8 times 19 is 152. Now we subtract 0, 0, 0. So 8, remainder 0. I hope that helps you. I will send a link. So a video I found that helps break it down even more too. If not, let me know.